The Panzerhaubitze 2000, commonly known as the PZH 2000, is a German 155mm self-propelled howitzer developed by KNDS Deutschland and Rheinmetall in the 1980s and 1990s for the German Army. First entering service in 1998, this weapon system represents one of the most advanced self-propelled artillery systems in the world. The primary armament of the PZH 2000 is the Rhine Metal 155mm L52 artillery gun. This 52 caliber weapon features a chromium-lined barrel extending 8 meters in length. The howitzer can store 60 rounds of ammunition, which can be loaded by two operators in under 12 minutes, thanks to its automated loading system. The PZEH-2000's ammunition capabilities are extensive and versatile. It fires standard NATO 155mm rounds with various types available. The standard DM-121 Boatail High Explosive Round has an effective range of 30 kilometers and contains approximately 9.14 kilograms of TNT. When paired with Rheinmetall's extender range charge, these ranges increase significantly. 36 kilometers with the DM-121 Boatail, 47 kilometers with the M0121 Base Bleed Round, and an impressive 67 kilometers with the M2005 Long Range Rocket Assisted Projectile. The PZH-2000 can also deploy sophisticated munitions like the Smart 155 Artillery Round. Each Smart 155 projectile weighs 47 kilograms and carries two sensor-fused submunitions. After ejection over the target area, each parachuted submunition independently searches for targets using advanced sensors. These are particularly effective against armored vehicles and artillery positions. The PZH-2000's fire control system features a fully automated loading, laying, and clearing process. The turret includes a phased array radar on the front glacis that measures the muzzle velocity of every round fired, ensuring exceptional accuracy. The system can automatically receive laying data via encrypted radio from the battery fire direction center. One of the most impressive features is the PZH-2000's ability to perform multiple round simultaneous impact. It can fire several rounds in rapid succession with different trajectories, all timed to hit multiple targets simultaneously. This gives the PZH-2000 devastating effects against a target area and makes counter-battery fire much more difficult. The rate of fire is equally impressive. Three rounds in nine seconds for burst fire or a sustained rate of 10 rounds per minute. The system's high level of automation allows for rapid target engagement and repositioning, implementing the modern artillery doctrine of shoot and scoot to avoid counter-battery fire. Armor protection consists of welded steel resistant to 14.5 mm extra heavy machine guns with additional bomblet protection on the roof. The PZH-2000 weighs 55.8 tons in combat configuration and measures 11.7 meters long, 3.6 meters wide, and 3.1 meters high. It is powered by an MTU-MT 881K500 engine, producing 986 horsepower, giving it a power-to-weight ratio of 17.92 horsepower per ton. Mobility is exceptional for a vehicle of this size and weight. It can reach road speeds of 67 kilometers per hour, and 45 kilometers per hour off-road, with an operational range of 420 kilometers. This mobility allows the PZH-2000 to keep pace with advancing armor units and quickly reposition to support operations across the battlefield. Its combination of firepower, range, accuracy, and mobility has established it as one of the most capable artillery systems in modern warfare setting standards that other self-propelled howitzers strive to meet. The only downside is its steep price tag, coming in at 17 million euros each, making it a high-value target on the battlefield and a significant loss if destroyed on the battlefield. What is your favorite howitzer? Let us know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, please support the channel by liking, commenting, and sharing the video with your friends. Do not forget to subscribe for more analysis videos on military equipment. Thanks for watching Gunner Heat Tank.